Oh, hi there. Hmm. Well, isn't that really a proper spring weather? So finally, finally. So yeah, I'm here in northern Germany, so in Lower Saxon, and so behind me, you see a field of canola, rapeseed. Yeah, that's very typical. So that's the landscape in northern Germany here. You see very, very often a lot of large fields, amazing fields of canola. So that, that's all used uh, for the organic oil industry, so organic fuel industry, so some kind of environmental protection. On one hand, on the other hand, well, it looks great now, May. So, but the rest of the year, so it's like every monoculture, so it brings some problems, so especially for, for animals not used to that or something like that. So, anyway, uh, I don't want to talk about that for the moment. Weather is too great for that. So, I want to talk about spring tobacco. Spring tobacco. So, I brought some Samuel Gervin. That's springtime flag. And I'll tell you what it is. So they say it's different Virginias and it's mixed with a little bit of Perique. And this Perique uh, this has, has had some time in, in sherry uh, barrels. So there's a little bit of sherry flavor <coughs> in it, they say. Uh, yeah, that's it. It's a natural sweet tobacco, little bit of spiciness, and it's a, well they say it's a rather strong flake, so, well, I don't think so. Well, I'll show you the tobacco. Mm. When it comes to Samuel Gallet, I'm always a bit suspicious about the, yeah, about the humidity. So, but in this, well in this case, I think it's absolutely all right. So you can give it a little bit of drying, but I, I don't think that's, you don't really have to. So you could, but I didn't do it, it's okay. So it looks nice, a little bit of rubbed. So when it comes to the the smell, I think, yeah, it's sweetness of Virginia, a little bit of honey, little bit of vanilla, but just a hint, and some citrus notes, and a little bit of hay, but it's okay, not too much hay, although I know some of you, you even like that. easily packed. You can rub it a bit or just use the fold and stuff method. It's okay. Both methods, methods will work with that. So I just rubbed it a little bit. Burns pretty well. So the taste. The taste is interesting, I think. So I read some reviews and they say it's honey, it's vanilla and so on. For me, but that's just for me, of course, it's mainly citrus. So, yeah, I think sometimes you hear in reviews, yeah, this Virginia has typical Virginia citrus notes. And, and sometimes I don't know what, what they mean by that because I can't really taste it. But in this case, it's different. So I really taste the citrus notes. So for me, it's very citrus. 
a little bit of honey, and then typical Virginia sweetness. It's a fine tobacco, so I think it's a proper smoke uh, for the spring. So because the citrus notes provide some freshness, so that's that's a good thing for this kind of weather, I think. So what's left is the price. It's 12 euros, 85 cent here in Germany. That's a lot, but anyway, if you like it, it's really a good smoke. So, hope you guys are all right and everything is fine. Hope you have nice spring weather, not too warm perhaps, not too cold. So, I just hope you take care. Be well and perhaps see you again.